My name is Kathleen Lanzoni. I live in Boulder, Colorado. This will be my fourth year in the Governor's Art Show and I'm very excited to be included for four years in a row. I do many jobs in the art world. I've been painting all my life. My first art class, I was three years old. Um, I did go to school as a professional artist in illustration is what I studied. And I've been a professional artist ever since. I did architectural renderings for over 10 years and I have been doing gallery work, plein air events and murals and teaching. For this year's Governor's Art Show, I decided water was gonna be my theme. I love to paint water, the reflections, the colors, the movement, and I wanted to paint different types of water. So the four scenes I have are all from Colorado, but different types of water. And still water, and then I have a stream, and I have a lily pad, and sunset, so it depends on the lighting and the color as well. The large painting I have here to my side is called In a Dream. And I originally created a plein air painting of this up in Rocky Mountain National Park at Dream Lake. And the really fun fact about this painting is that while I was painting, I'm standing in the shadows and the rocks and the trees, and nobody even knew I was there. A young couple went over by the edge of the water and the gentleman got down on his knee and he proposed to her right there in front of me. They had no idea I was there. It was the funniest thing. Um, I couldn't hear them, but I could see the whole thing in action. So I took pictures for them and I sent them to later. So it was just a, it was just one of those wonderful things that happen when you're playing your painting that you never would have imagined. Um, so then I went home and I did a studio version of it, uh, changed the lighting a little bit, moved some trees around to get it how I want the right composition. So that was one of the great scenes. Um, otherwise, sunsets, I love the colors and it changes so fast. So again, did a plein air piece, very small, very fast, and then came home and painted it in the studio again. Um, I have another one called Lily Lake, and that is of a smooth water surface with the lilies and the mountains in the background. And then the other large piece I have is called Cascading Falls, and it is a waterfall, and I really wanted to get the motion. So again, you, you go out plein air painting and the light changes so fast and so rapidly. So when I arrived at the stream, it's just outside of Georgetown in Colorado, the light would hit certain areas and the shadow would hit certain areas. So I love the way the, uh, the water just sparkles and then the bubbles pop up. And um, so that's what I was really trying to capture is the depth in there. And then the front is all in shadow. So I just, I just love the movement of the water and that's what I was capturing in that scene. I love being a Colorado artist. <laughs> um, I think being a Colorado artist, we have this great benefit of, again, I do a lot of plein air, so a huge variety of subject matter, right? Um, and Colorado has so many fantastic artists, so I'm, I'm proud to be a part of that group. The skill and the quality of the other artists in the show is very high. So I feel very honored to be a part of this group. It's a great event. Um, they, it's a beautiful gallery and it's a great organization. So the money goes to the gallery, the artists, and for the school system. So I feel very honored to be a part of that and I enjoy being a part of it. We're thrilled that the, the Loveland Museum and Gallery is having the exhibit. Um, I'm excited to be able to help sponsor the Thompson Valley School System. And I encourage you to come if you could see the show online or come see the show in person and support all these great groups. Um, come see the artwork. Um, people have worked very hard and are excited and proud of what they've done, and we would love to share it with the public. So I hope you can come and see the show.